Hey everybody, y'all gaming here, bringing a 1v1 I did on ladder against a Terran. Dual casting with this, uh, my friend. Hey. Hey man. Yes, he's, uh, European. Yeah, hello guys, I'm from Croatia actually, so don't mind my accent. My English is pretty good, but I tend to fuck up, so I'm apologizing in advance. Alright, ready? Three, two, one, go. So this is me in the what the top <laughs> top position, red Zerg and blue Terran over here named Muffin. So yeah. This game should be interesting, just judging by the spawn positions, they're a little weird. Cross spawns, they don't usually happen on ladder. Yeah. Almost like MLG. It should be interesting. Yes, it should be interesting. Oh yeah guys, I've recently been, like five minutes ago, been demoted to Platinum and I'm kind of depressed right now. Just lost to a Protoss death ball and they demoted me. Kind of pissed off. Well, things tend to happen. I was struggling. I'm still struggling to get my ass to diamond. Don't know why, don't know how. I'm always first, I always win, and I just never get promoted. Well, I don't got promoted when season four started. Yeah, I wasn't that lucky. <laughs> so, standard, the Terran player is opening totally standard. Rax is on the way at 13. He'll probably put down his gas right now. Let me see. Still having his rally point set. Is he? He's walling off pretty quickly. Yeah, he's making second supply depot. But you're taking a fast hat, so you probably won't be even scouting him. That's, that's my uh, problem. My my lack of scouting sometimes. Well, that's actually pretty good. You went for a fast hatch. He won't be scouting so early because of the second supply depot. His orbital should be delayed. So is his gas and you probably wouldn't even be able to scout yeah. just because of that second supply depot very true I um I go for 14 hatch 16 pull I believe I'm getting my gas now it's pretty standard against Terran you're probably gonna get some speed links or some early map control yeah the first marine is up no aggression coming out from Muffin nope. And still no gas. He's sitting. Uh, he's floating over 400 minerals. Yep. He's going for a command center. So one rack since expansion. That's one rack expansion. Yes. Very interesting against Zerg. You can rarely see that in ladder gameplay if they're not like master or higher diamond something. Yes. Most uh, low level players do not know how to execute this right. It's not that hard, you just need to stay concentrated. Uh, and there you go, losing drone. So this was the first loss in the battle, and you're down 50 minerals. Yeah, it's not very good on my part. I uh, sent the drone in, wasn't looking at it, and lost it. Happens. Yeah. You can see the two queens on the way, zergling speed, getting that fast speed, just in case he wants to do some aggression. Well, there are two gas up for Terran player right now. He's probably trying to rush to factory. Yeah. Well, well one one gas has only one harvester in it. Oh no, never mind. Yeah, he just saturated. That that was a big mistake, actually. Yes. Pretty sure that's a mistake. I'm getting that spine crawler for early defenses. I like to play safe. Right now, I have no no clue. If you look at my vision, I don't even know like if he's there. But I know like I know because there's no close spawn but like I haven't seen his base once yet well he didn't even scout you out yet so oh, yeah. you're both playing in the dark right now not knowing what's happening and what's waiting for you whoa an early ghost academy yes. this and is something that you don't see that often against Zerg and factory is still not on the way but the second command, command center is still pumping SUVs into the main Yes. Not bad. Well, the Not worker count right now is 24, 26, but those meals make him ahead in in income. Actually, 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, mules are just overpowered yes. when Terran uses them, but they also have some downfalls. They mine out your bases much, uh, mine faster, so that's not that good. You really need to balance it, the scans and the mules. Otherwise, you just waste your minerals and you end up having 1k minerals and not doing, not knowing what to do with them. Yes. And guys, my I think my mom just pulled up. My brothers and sisters will be home soon. If you hear me uh, just say, uh, excuse me for a second, they'll be just like, he usually comes in, uh, drops his backpack down and goes to eat. So, so sorry for the interruption if it does happen pretty soon. And Stim on the way here and Concussive Shells and his first ghost coming out. Yeah, this is a big SUV transfer. I think he did a bit of an overkill. Yes. You really want to keep your natural natural saturated, but not that much. You don't want to exhaust it before your main because you just need it. You need the bottom expansion map control at your front ramp. And he's not researching cloak or Mobius reactors, so his ghosts are useless, basically. For now, yes. Uh, I'm really interested about what what he's going to do with those ghosts, yeah. because snipe against bailings and lings that's just not useful. And now he's getting cloak, and I'm about to grab my third. Maybe some nuclear gameplay, nuclear warfare. I don't know. I don't want to. That would be it. interesting. I don't know. I'm watching this replay for the first time, so. Yeah, and uh, he plays on European server. I play North American server. It's kind of uh, unfortunate we don't get to play against each other or with each other. <laughs> yeah, that would be a lot of fun. Well, when and if, not if, when I upgrade my PC, I'll tend to play more and tend to buy another copies of the game. I know I won't be buying the Korean version because that's just, oh my god. You play I would a Korean server, you're going to get your ass kicked. Yeah, that that would be. I would be like low level bronze there. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Korean you, players, you... they're really good. Yes. I I handed out to them like they're they're just awesome. The tactics and their mindset to like always win. I admire <laughs> them a lot. Yes. And if you can see his vision right now, he see he has no idea what I'm doing. All he sees is my spine crawler. I actually but saw that command center. Some yeah, you saw the expansion timing with two bunkers, so you know something's down. And I have this overlord positioned up there to see scout a third if it does come. Right now at the worker count, he is up by three. It's my mistake, I should have droned up a little harder. Well, you already, you already have mutas out, so there are like five mutalisks. Yes. So that's a big drone cut. But you can, if you get a good harass out of his mineral line, you should be okay. But there are a lot of turrets going down already. It's, he senses a uh, 10 minute muta, so I guess he, that's kind of, there's a lot of turrets. Well, basically no early game aggression tells you that the Zerg player will go mutas. Yes, and I sniped the SCV right before the turn finishes. And I thought it was only it was his only turn, and I spot him and just get out of there. Pick off as many SCVs as I can. Your base is looking good. Yeah, upgrades on the way. Yes. Pretty good timings and everything. Now I'm past him on drones, so basically I've droned up behind that 51 to 46 now. Income tab, I have a lead. Gases are about the same. He's still creating a ghost. How many ghosts are on the field? Seven ghosts on the field. Does he have any nukes? Yeah, two more ghosts are on the way. Oh wow. It surprised and me. He three more raxes. Three raxes. Oh. Still no factory or am I wrong? No, He's there doing, is no uh, factory on the field. Straight up ghost bioplay, I guess. No many well, backs. That's a fail. Like, <laughs> Bainlings. <laughs> and you win. Yes. It's as easy as that. But I still don't know there's ghosts. Still never realized there's ghosts. Uh I saw the ghost academy. But in, in real game, I didn't see that Ghost Academy. I was too stupid to look. And, uh, yeah. Oh my god, this is an overkill. Five mules on one base. <laughs> he needs to take an expansion pretty quickly. He's sitting on 50 SUVs on two bays. That's really bad for Terran. He's overkill. He's, uh, he's just stacking his minerals for nothing, and he doesn't have enough production facilities to, to waste them. 
And if you look at his main, there's but much less SCVs than natural. His natural is getting pretty close to already being mined out. That's weird. It's a supply cow about the village. Third base. I'm I'm pretty sure like at at this point what's going through my mind is I don't see a third base at like, 13 minutes, so I think something's up. I check around the map, I still don't see a third base. Yeah, and he basically doesn't have a force. He needs siege tanks and he needs them now. Yeah, the factory is done, but these timings are so off. And you see 11 overlords on the production tab. I really got tired of getting supply blocked. <laughs> I know how that feels, with Zerg <laughs> especially. Uh, I don't know, my, my overlord placement wasn't good. If you look at my natural, it's just a bunch of overlords just standing there blocking my view. That's actually good at, in some situations. If the Terran just goes steam marines and tries to attack your natural, the AI might get a bit messy if the overlords are just standing there doing nothing. Yeah. Uh, see, now I see all the ghosts. He just snipes a lot of my mutilists. Oh, excuse me, guys. I gotta go open the door. My parents home. You take it from here. Interesting. Just keep going. I wonder, will the Terran player be able to do something with his army? Because this composition is... So, I'm um, back. Hello? Hello? So yeah, a lot of lanes here. You guys can see. Hello? Yeah, I'm here. Wait, did you disconnect or did I disconnect? Uh, I don't know, it was a lag, I guess. Oh. Nothing much. Alright, let's get back into this. First siege yeah, tank, uh, a siege mode finally coming out. I think this is just too late. You're preparing to move out and his army composition is just not that good to handle banelings and links <coughs> all at the same time. Yeah. My mistake here was getting only one overseer. I realized you can just snipe that ghost really quickly. I mean snipe the overseer really quickly with his ghost. And I uh, have no no uh, way. See he's walling off with a bunch of supply depots. I don't know how I feel about that. I think that this is just gonna be a steamroll. Even if all of his ghosts survive, cloak and snipe just won't be enough to take all of that force down. Drone count now, 63 to 54. He still doesn't have a third base at the 17 minute mark. Yeah, turn players should actually get a third, like, 16 minutes. That's the latest, I guess. I yeah, well, his command center is morphing into an orbital, but this is just late. I oh think he God. sees all the bailings, but it makes a huge wall in. That doesn't help. <laughs> If one supply depot falls, your ball is completely dead. Yeah. See, and uh, just now, siege tanks coming up, too. Yeah. Oh my god. 17 minutes now. This is not good for him. This, dude, I don't know if this is a two-parter or Because it's like a 20-minute game. He sees what's going on. How many ghosts does he have? Thir 22. Yeah, that's a lot of ghosts, but they just can't save him. And he's moving There's out. No what way. is he doing? He is moving out. This is a bad engagement. I, I wasn't paying attention. And now I see. Just pay attention to my overseer. I think he sniped you real quick. Yeah, well, that's a good move. Now, nice reaction. But I, there I, isn't much more he can do, actually. You win or lose, Chuck. I uh, manually detonate these bandages and kill the ghosts. <laughs> I don't, yeah, that was a good that's move. the way to do it, but you didn't catch much of them, though. <laughs> Well, they were run, ran out of cloak. They're running out of cloak as we speak. So this game should be pretty much wrapped up. Yeah, you still have you still have some units and siege tanks are just coming up. Yee! <laughs> He's got two of them. 
doing nothing. Well, this time I'm learning from my mistakes. I'm uh, getting four overseers bringing them. And there's no way you can snipe that many before I kill them. If you noticed, he didn't put up his third just because you were having a Ling right there, staying and doing nothing. You could have Burrow that if you researched it. I guess. Nope, you didn't research Burrow. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> and yeah, he's, he's transferring just too much SUVs from place to place. Really needed to balance that a bit more. Finally gets a third at about 20 minutes in the game, but at this point I'm just getting ready to kill, uh, kill him over here. Yeah, and this is gonna be so one-sided. <laughs> and yeah, this is the GG. Yeah, Nothing G much he can do. Okay. Yeah, this was uh, my friend, the European guy. <laughs> or uh, his uh, name, and Andrija. Andrea, it's easier to call me Andrew actually. That's my English version of the name. Oh, alright. See you guys, thanks for watching. Bye.